choose. I choose Aaron Hodger. He's a classic narcissist. He thinks he's better than everyone else on the team. Genesis 23, 4. Let him not deceive himself and trust in emptiness, vanity, falseness, and futility. For these shall be his recompense. For God's will. I'm not a narcissist. Oh, come on, look, you can't take anything from me. It's not what I'm talking right about. Now. No, stop, stop. Uh, all right, everybody right now, what's my worst quality? Okay, I'll start. I have no sense of humor. You're a bully. I'm a bully. You can be a drill sergeant sometimes. Right. You don't trust women as much as men. Okay, good. I'm all these things, but none of you said that I ever put myself above the team because I don't, ever. Reed and I argued about the definition of classic narcissism, and he knew that I would remember that. And he also quoted Genesis chapter 23, verse 4. Read it. I am a stranger and a sojourner with you. Give me property for a burial place among you, that I may bury my dead out of my sight. He wouldn't get it wrong unless it was on purpose. He's in a cemetery. I don't see a cemetery. Call up the first time we saw Reed. I won't choose who gets slaughtered and have you leave their remains behind like a poacher. Check to see if there are reports of poaching in the last couple of days. Hey, uh, farmer reported two sheep being slaughtered on his property. What are we talking? Well, what's that patch of grain there? Marshall Parish. I think it's an old plantation. Slaughtered. Same as the others. We've got roadblocks for a 15-mile radius. Every unit's on the road, but so far, nothing. I don't know how much longer Reed can hold out. Who are the victims? Pam in my case. He was a local defense attorney. What Bible passage was left? Isaiah 59. No one calls for justice. No one pleads their case with integrity. They rely on empty arguments. They offer lies. They conceive trouble and give birth to evil. Reed, if you're watching, you're not responsible for this. You understand me? He's perverting God to justify murder. You are stronger than him. He cannot break you. Thought you were gonna try and get some rest. When else is working? I should be too. We can handle it. It's funny, I keep thinking uh, the one thing we need to crack this case is uh well, Reed. Yeah. You think Reed and I should have stayed together at the barn, don't you? JJ, go get some rest. I can tell that's what you're thinking, so. I just want to get Reed home safe. But if I had his back, like, like I was supposed to, he'd be here now. JJ, what do you want from me? I just, I want someone to tell me the truth. The truth is, one of you is here and one of you isn't. You gotta figure the rest out for yourself. We're not getting any closer. Reed's brilliant. He'll figure out how to survive. You know, I always take advantage of Reed for his brain, but I never actually teach him how to deal with things emotionally. Mm -hmm.